right, we got some good friends of mine here at the burn yard today. The boys from Animal Style finally got them to come to the lot. A lot of you guys have asked for it, and the time is now. What you know about grassroots drifting, boys? About to learn something right now. Yeah, you know some Been stuff. Doing it for a long time. You know time. some stuff. You know but some I know stuff. That these guys are the most stylish. Hey! What are you guys doing here? Oh, oh, hit him with it, Jason. Hit him with it. Hit him with it. Hey, hit him with it. <laughs> All right, that's. <laughs> oh, what's up, boys? Hey. Welcome to the burn yard. Thank you for coming. I damn, you just like I gotta like look way up to. I well, first for, yeah. I'm more of, uh, yeah. Oh, what's up, boys? What's up? How you doing? Uh, good. For the people, introduce yourselves. Uh, my name is Julian. I'm Jason, also referred to as Baby J. You guys have been friends for a long time. I met you eight years ago, here actually at Irwindale Speedway. I think it was uh, Pro-Am All-Stars or something like that. And I just know I saw him, he was driving a car down on power and smoking everybody. So I was like, ooh, I like that guy. And it was slammed and everything, so it was really cool. It was also Kato's car too. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> big Kato though, right? Yeah, yeah. big Kato, not Baby Kato, big Kato. <laughs> Everyone's gonna get confused. They're like, wait, were you were driving yeah, Brandon Cotto's another, car? There's another Cotto yeah. that's not Kakao. There's <laughs> one right in the middle. I was there with Pat Gooden and you took him out with three cylinders. I was like, damn, man. man. Uh, that was the day I finished that car. Off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it was a good time. It was cool that we met then and we've been friends for a long time. And, and you've evolved quite a bit since. You've gone through a lot of different phases in cars. First things first, tell us about Animal Style, how long it's been, and why you guys do it. We've been messing around since 2009. That's where me and Ryan met. We were doing little events on the skid pad at Thunder Hill. Ryan came in, he was like this little kid in a Corolla, and he was just not all of us. I was, at first I was like, who is this kid, dude? He's so good. We became friends and we started playing Forza together. Just we drove together so much on there and we were like, we need to execute this in real life. So we started driving together more at uh, Thunder Hill. We were doing comps and we met Jason. It's been fun ever since. Animal style. How'd you guys come up with that name? And me and Ryan were throwing names around and we, were, we threw it out there as a joke and we were like, no, nah, that's stupid. Weren't and you man. like, uh, for All-Star Bash, it was Team Falcon Punch yeah, we, or something we, like that? We had Team Falcon Punch? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> you guys you guys made the right changes. <laughs> but but I remember, well, ba back then, Falcon Punch was huge on the internet. I don't so. even know what that is. <laughs> Falcon Punch. Yeah. It was like that was early meme days, man. <laughs> Are these yeah, yeah, the cars yeah. you guys actually shipped to Japan last year? Yeah. So tell us about yours, and then we'll got hop into Jason's. Just give us a quick rundowns, because obviously this is the first tandems we're gonna have at the lot, so we're excited. Yeah. So we don't want to take too long. Yo. Wow. Yeah. I just. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Is that carbon fiber? Is that a wrap? It's, it's silver yeah, carbon. It's silver, silver carbon, and I did candy over the top of it. I never even thought about doing anything like that. That looks really sick. It yeah, actually like, works like this silver, really like good as a thing. metallic base. Origin everything, I'm assuming. Origin. Gotta love Origin Lab. Aggressive kit, type 3 fenders, type 2 hood, GT wing, roof wing, all Origin. Everything Origin. And this is actual Sylvia from Japan. Yep. Yeah, this yeah. is not even tube front or anything. Nope. Uh, keep it so, simple. So Animal Style's mantra right now is keep it simple, stupid. I'm trying to drive as much as possible. I have an actual question that doesn't need to go on the internet, but was <laughs> this car used to be like dumped, right? This one was a little bit lower at one point, but... Uh, the S14 it. was one of the lowest okay. cars. So I was like, how the hell are those factory tubs working? Oh yeah, because he's dealing with I'm some dealing S14. With that <laughs> 
We gon' get nasty for hundred shit, hundred shit, hundred shit, hundred Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Not the end up on the internet, but I was just kidding. <laughs> well, I actually wanted to know. That's a knuckle question, too. Though. Yeah. Like, this is super tame. My man's got yeah. a clutch fan. It's pretty basic. I love it. Yeah, it's pretty much a stock SR, credit cams. GTX Turbo uh, through MMP, the Jazz Manifold. What do you guys got for suspension and everything? Stance to the jam. Angle. B, B knuckle. Nauki's signature. I like this. The intercooler sits like so nice and tucked under the rad support. Yeah, that's a Park Shop Max intercooler. That's the same one I had on the S14. It's yeah, that's cool. It's pretty OG. It's nice really and tidy in there. Keeps it safe too. Clutch fan. Clutch fan, man. Never clutch fan. Off. Yeah, clutch fan with the shroud. It's guaranteed cooling. It's, There's... Hard, it's hard to warm it up. Yeah. That's sick. That's, <laughs> a, good, that's a great problem to have. Well, this is three quarters of the shroud. Yeah. Good old. Coyo Good old Coyo. Right. What uh, what are you running for boost in? 17 pounds before the couplers were blowing out the boost, so. You made what for power? Like a little over 300. 300 though, I've seen videos of this car. It looks like it eats for 300 horsepower. It's, 300's enough. You yeah. You need much more to. It's good information. Yeah, but being a dickhead's awesome too. No! <laughs> <laughs> right, Mr. Boy. 2J single yeah. turbo. You can't have yeah. a single turbo two. Single turbo. You can't have a single turbo 2J under 500 horsepower. Don't, don't have one. I guarantee he will not finish his car without one. We're taking bets? Well, we're yeah. on the same bet yeah. though. Yeah. Bet Dan, how much you want to put down? <laughs> yeah. It seems like you keep this thing pretty. <laughs> Don't say it. <laughs> No, that's good. That's uh, good. Honestly, was... all of the, the livery really covers up like oh, I didn't yeah. even notice that like this is like punched in. That's probably like, him. And the door smashed you, did you, did, in. Did you do that? <laughs> but like the livery makes it look super clean. From like ten feet away it looks brand that, new. That's one of the good things about having hella stickers. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice these roof Johnny. Yo, is this silver carbon again? Yeah. That's so cool. Take notes. I'm stealing stuff. I want to take I'm notes on how the dude mounted his seats because <laughs> he's so yeah. tall. Yeah, and they fit. He lays down yeah. while oh, he drives. Man, if you see see the adapters on the steering wheel, he literally lays well, down. Me, I, yeah. What the yeah. f is going on there? I drove Julian's car like this, and I needed two pillows under my butt and one behind me. At that point, I'm sitting above the bucket too. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to drive his car at Spirit Peaks and like kind of falling all over. And no I just got it. Yeah. yeah, oh yeah, there, go ahead. Let's go. From a not normal person at all. Oh, I can almost hit the clutch. <laughs> the wheel's actually not in a bad spot though. I will say that. But I don't think I could pull a- Just need some boots. I can't put the clutch in. <laughs> <laughs> this car you got is straight from Japan. I remember when you got it. The, the interior is basically the same, huh? Yeah, it yeah. was. Uh, it was on the Japan Yahoo auctions, and I found it, and I was like, "Damn, that's so nice." It was almost like a show car. Like the dude definitely didn't drift it. There was no tire uh, uh, no dust on the wheel wells or anything. There's it was super nice. There's and TVs then, in your. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It came with all that. Do these work? Not right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so a little half cage and super simple car essentially. SR, 300 horsepower, nice boost, angle, B knuckle, stance coilovers, origin everything. No hydro on both of your cars? Yeah. Let's go ahead and hop over you, Jason. Let's... Okay. Yeah. Yo, this is next level. Yo. Putting your car <laughs> on your car. Yeah. Under a tight yeah. <laughs> lion mouth. Yo, no, seriously. And that's the is... demagical creation. <laughs> Amazing. Yes, that's awesome. Jason, I, I've loved all the revisions of your cars over the years. You you have one of my favorite S13s for sure. It's so good. Thank you, thank you. But tell us about it. How long have you had this thing? So this is my first 240, first drift car current drift car. So I bought it two months before my 16th birthday right? and 27 now. So, so I've so. had the car for like almost 11 years yeah. at this point. Daily drove it in high school and stuff, kind of messed around on the streets. Like had a single cam, it was automatic. Like did the whole five speed swap, cut springs. You went through all the basic I steps from the, basic yeah. steps. Like I always, everybody always told me like, go grab a cone and go start doing circles around it. So yeah. like, okay, I'm gonna go grab yeah. a cone and start doing circles around it. And, that's funny, that's how I started too. Yeah. <laughs> Same thing, seriously. Yeah, so I had like a small group of friends in high school and stuff that were kind of into it and stuff. And my very first drift event was at Thunder Hill Raceway at a skid pad and that's where I met Julian and our buddy Al. Probably the first two years that I knew Julian he was always driving Al's car. Anyway, so it was like, <laughs> Shout so out to Al. Al, I wish he was here. I so, love Al. So, so 11 years of evolution Yeah. and now you're here. Pop the hood, let's see this bad boy. Oh, oh boy. You got a big boy. So this SR I've had for almost six years now. Can you explain to people why your car sounds like a rotary? 
manifold, <laughs> dock race ram horn manifold. That probably combined with like, I got big Tomei 280 Pro Cam. Oh really? You running yeah. 280s in this bad boy? 280s. Oh, check out so that manifold too. Solid lifters. What kind of power? Just under four on a all-wheel drive Mustang Dyna. Plenty to party. Yeah, so at like 15 pounds of boost. Though. Good old SR, good old single turbo. What trans yeah. you run in this thing? So I run a Z32 trans, same as Julian. Hey, I think we heard enough. Yeah, right. I, only thing we haven't heard is these things sing. Okay. You got time to pee? You got to warm up your car for like an hour, right? Yeah. It's true. All right. <laughs> so don't let these guys calm this for you. Once they get behind the wheels, they are full animal. <laughs> Kurt, you know what I'm, I'm, I'm actually disappointed that you haven't addressed. What? What's our man's driving shoe of choice? Oh, come on. Oh man, you had to match him too. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Let him know. Let him know. Crackle like it's hot. <clears throat> Crack, crack like it's hot. Crack Meanwhile, this chump Coach. is driving with his feet sweaty. Yeah. That's why he wins all the competitions. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> crack like it's hot. We're going to have to get a foot cam on you. He's got him locked up, too. I, I'm not oh, locked up because I'm not driving. Oh, yeah. When yeah. you're driving, you need a lock. Exactly, but I'm free roaming right now, so I'm chilling, but you're ready to rock. Free roaming. You're ready to crack animal. lock. Crack <laughs> rock. Do you have crocodiles on your feet? No. <laughs> what is that junk? Vans? They're going to fall apart. You guys ready? You need to be locked Let's in. Do it. You guys ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't, let that, don't let that beautiful look fool you. He's an animal. Jason's the manliest baby I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's party time. <laughs> you guys can do whatever you want. Ascended from zip ties. Are there still zip ties? Are oh, there still zip ties? <laughs> <laughs>
fucking sick, dude. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yo, are you kidding? Yeah. First, first try. Are you? <laughs> Yo, you literally bumper clip. First try. It was perfect. <laughs> We just witness. I saw what was going on there, but then it, it oh, was better over yeah. here, and then it was better over there. And, uh, and like I everywhere. said, these guys are super tame when they speak, but they're animals behind the wheel. Oh my gosh, how many times do I have to tell you people? I feel stupid now. <laughs> Micah, it would be me and you catching it. <laughs> <laughs> we would try. <laughs> <laughs>